Hey fish family, welcome back to yet again another unboxing here at Jay Oliver's Guppies and Aquatics. Um, today's going to be a little bit different because um, I'll go ahead and show you a quick bag. Um, I've got two boxes here in front of me already, but he had to use um, colored bags this time because he ran out of the clear ones. And uh, if you're unfamiliar, most people use these colored bags for bettas uh, so they don't see each other in the bag and stress out during shipping. Um, so this time I'm just going to go through and show you each bag, at least let you know what strain I got at first, and then I'm going to do video footage of them um, like in a specimen container. I'll get three or so of each uh, strain out and do videos like that for you guys so you can see them. But uh, first off, we'll, we'll go through each bag and show you what strains I got, and there may be some surprise strains in here. I'm not sure what's in here altogether. But um, overall, I'm very, very grateful for you, for everything that's been going on this year. Um, the people I've been buying from, business has been going well. I'm very, very grateful um, for all the support you guys at home show me. It truly, truly means a lot, and I would not be here doing this if it wasn't for you. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. I really do mean that. It's been this... Um, this life that I've been able to live um, importing fish and selling them all over the United States has been, it's been stressful, I'm not going to lie, there's been some moments that really, really can be frustrating, but overall, I feel truly blessed to be able to have this opportunity, and uh, it's take a lot of research, uh, making sure I keep these fish healthy as possible, you know, that, that was a whole learning process, and I uh, I feel like I've got a pretty good grip on it now. I, I'm just really, this past year has been the best year yet, uh, about out of the over four years I've been importing. And I just pray that it continues to get better every year. Um, as always, I put these fish, new imports, go through at least two weeks of quarantine with, uh, without issue. If I see any issue in a tank, um, Time starts over until they seem completely happy again and they go two weeks after that period. So if I see something break out and like uh, maybe they're not acting right for like a week and then they start acting better, from the time they start acting better, it's another two weeks before I sell them just to make sure I provide only the healthiest fish I can for you guys. And I feed the best quality foods I possibly can find live baby brine shrimp uh, pretty much every single day and Dr. Bassie Lear's uh, granule food is uh, my preferred favorite foods for my guppies. Um, Alright, so I think that's about it for an intro. Let's go ahead and get started. So, sorry again, these bags are going to be a bit noisy, uh, but we'll try to go through them quickly and I'll get them, I'll just show you a bag like this one here. Let's see. It says metal bluegrass. It's going to be upside down, but I know what it says anyway. Metal bluegrass. So, and again, I'll pull the bags out just to show you. They're colored, but there's like, it's like a little line there you can see through. You've seen it just swim by. You can kind of see its shadow, <laughs> but as you can see, I just can't show you the fish in the bag clearly with these bags. There's only one little clear strip on them and everything else is solid. So, metal bluegrass. Next up, we got leopards. I love these. These leopards have been really nice. There's it. He's in there swimming. There he is. Hi! <laughs> There's the leopards. What's next? Oosh, next up we got the snakeskin fire red mosaics. These have been a, a really nice strain to have. I at least want to pull the bags out and see a fish swimming. Yep, look, he's right there. Or I think that's a girl. No, it's one of the males. Hard to tell when you just see a face at first. It is in there. That's a good sign. All right, next up is gold lace, uh, snakeskin gold lace, otherwise known. Bag of them. I see a swimming fish in there. 
at least show you this real quick. It's hard to tell, but there's a fish in there. <laughs> Alright. What have we got next? White King Cobras. Alright, so I'll have to see how these look. I'm always, I haven't imported this particular strain very much. I can't even see. That strip's covered up. I can't see it. Yep, there's fish in there. It's hard to see them though. All right, I'm not gonna waste too much time doing that because I'm gonna show you show you them later after I get them unbagged. Then we got ivory king cobras. So we got ivory and white. Sorry, if there's a glare on that. And then we got albino full reds. And we got galaxy neon blue tails. This was a very popular strain the past few months. Sorry, there's a glare on that. Let's see, next up, snakeskin red lace. We got albino koi. Lots of wonderful strings. Then we have albino blue tails. Very popular. Next up, bluegrass. Hard to see that. Bro, oh, that's so glary. Bluegrass. They go bag of them. Next up. Ooh, one of, another really popular one. Metal black tail. First box, coral blue tails. Now this definitely a very very popular strain. This may be this is definitely the top three most purchased strain this year. Is my coral blue tails? Another big bag of them. All right, that's it for the first box. Over. Oh, All right. Now again, I'm sorry for the loud bag. We got red dragon. Full gold. Yellow Tiger King Cobras. It's hard to read that. But I'm trying to at least show you the name, I guess. Got Santa Claus. Next up, Galaxy Purple Tails. I got a few of these in a couple of imports back and they sold super fast. Hard to see that. Next up, Blue Dragon. Bag is the Dumbo Red Tail. Big old bag of them. We got next up is Dumbo Red Mosaic. Got 
Tuxedo, well he writes Tuxedo Rose Tail, other known, otherwise known as Half Black Rose Tails. Next up, Red Grass. See that? Red Grass. Alright, the last strain in the box, but there's two of them because this is the, I ordered a lot, it's Purple Mosaic. Very, very good strain. So this is a bag of mail, the Purple Mosaic mail. And the last bag in the box, with a whole bunch of fish in it, is uh, the female Purple Mosaics. There's a whole bunch in there. These are all the females. Alright. Well, I'll set that down for now. And I guess that's it for this part. Um, hope you like this new shirt I just got in from Aquarium Co-op and this hat, actually. I've been very happy. Uh, the hat fits really nice, comfortable, qual good quality shirt. I really like the color of the green on it. Very happy with it. Love the quality of their apparel they got. Not just their fish foods or their all their products are great, including apparel. So if you're looking for shirts or hats or anything that are aquarium related, maybe check out Aquarium Co-op. Links below. Again, thank you. I'll see you when I start unboxing them. Get them in a specimen container. All right, guys. Here we are. It's several hours later. I finally got everything in the tanks. I figured I'll just show you guys this way. Um, I'm not going to take time to pull them all in specimen containers. I'll show you them in the I'll show you them in the tanks now. Um, these tanks that you see a little bit more yellow, I've already started adding medicine to. Uh, a few of them, I was halfway through medicine, and I was like, you know what? I'll just go ahead and film this now. Um, they just got all fed baby, a live baby brine shrimp. So I'll show you guys uh, real quick. We'll go through and look at them. They're acting very well. Super happy with everything. So we'll start off with uh, bluegrass. Again, this tank has medication in it already, so it's gonna be a bit, um, there's gonna be a color to it, but you can see them very well. Nice fin shape, looking good, very active. Uh, next, we got the snakeskin red lace. Very, very pleased. Looking good. Yeah, I like these guys. Again, active, very happy. Here we are with the full golds, swimming around. Uh, so far, not too many, hadn't seen too many um, issues. Everything's looking good. These are the red grass. Uh, next, we got some blue dragons. Uh, this tank hadn't got any medications in it yet, so it's still pretty clear. Blue dragons are looking good be hard to focus. Uh, next up, purple mosaics. Looking really well, swimming around. Show you a top view. Show you this bottom view. They're looking great. I'll move that bucket, try to get the glare out of the way. And I will be posting videos of these guys uh, inside specimen containers with better lighting so you can really see what they look like. But super happy, great color. Next we got red dragons, very happy, looking good. Uh, next we got ivory king cobras, again it's going to be a little blurry and the water itself isn't super clear but um, the lighting I have isn't set up perfectly yet so it's still causing a little bit of a glare. Uh, next we'll show you the coral blue tails. Super good looking, all very active. Again, these guys just got out of the bags a couple hours ago. Looking good, very very nice color. Uh, next, we'll go Dumbo Red Mosaics. Got plenty of them in again. Super pleased, they always look great. Very, very nice. Uh, these were the white uh, King Cobras. 
Again, I got medicine in here, but they're pretty. Very, very pretty fish. Uh, next, we'll go the RREA full red, albino full reds. Very, very nice. Very dark coloring. Females look good. Uh, we got leopards. They came in looking really nice. Females look good and big. Males have really nice fins on them. <laughs> uh, then we got the snake skin red mosaics. Very pleased with these guys. The beautiful fish. Snake skin red mosaics. Uh, next, metal bluegrass. Again, this has the medication in it, so it's already a bit yellow. But they look really nice. Uh, let's see, I think that's it for over here. Um, Galaxy Neon Blue Tails. Looking really good. And beside them are Galaxy Purple Tails. Very, very pretty. Sorry for the glare. There we go. And next we'll go the albino koi. Very pretty fish. I love these females. Red faces. Beautiful fish. Nice big bodies. Very, very pleased. Um, I'm not going to show you anything I didn't import. I have other tanks, you know, that I didn't put new fish in. Uh, these are the snakeskin gold lace that just came in. Very, very nice. The lighting's not super great on this tank. It's a little cloudy from... Uh, adding just disturbing the water <clears throat> mm -hmm. and then down here we got more of the yellow uh, king cobras or tiger kings in here again sorry for the glare try to avoid that but they look really nice I'll be ha I'll have better videos when I get done all right so I'm gonna move over to the next tank one second all right, these are the metal blacks that just got in. Looking really, really good. Very nice body patterns. The females look really, really nice. Big bodies. Don't have a light over this tank, so I'm using my camera light right now. But yeah, looking really well. Very, very pleased. I'll back up a little bit. Very active. All right, I'm gonna go to the next fish room and show you, I believe, the last two strains that I got in. One sec. Now, before I leave the first fish room, I almost forgot to show you the half black rose tails. Super, super pretty strain. And very, very popular. <clears throat> I just can't get enough of these guys. Got a lot of babies in here from previous batches. But yeah, they're looking really good. All right, we'll move on to the uh, Dumbo Red Tails. All right, here we are at the Dumbo Red Tails. Again, looking really good. Nice fat females. Don't really see much of any uh, internal parasite issues visually, but I still treat for it anyway just to be safe. Uh, make sure I provide the healthiest fish I can. But yeah, these guys look really, really nice. Very, very pretty. All right, guys, here we are at the uh, albino blue tails, or otherwise known as the albino topaz. Super pretty strain. Very, very nice and active. Again, big bodies, nice big fins, look pretty. Uh, this water's pretty murky because I, I just did a big water change uh, to get it ready for them. So it's, it's a little cloudy right now, but they look great. Very, very pleased with them. And right above them are the last strain uh, that I believe I've showed you all of them. These are the Santa Claus. They look really nice. The males have solid white pectoral fins. Uh, the females have really nice white, uh, bluish to red, a variety of tail fins. Very, very pretty. So overall, very, very pleased. These guys look good too. All right, I think that'll about do it. I appreciate you guys watching and uh, stay tuned if you haven't subscribed yet please do thank you so much 
If you uh, will, please consider hitting the like button. Uh, that really helps get uh, these videos shared around YouTube. And again, thank you so much, guys. Uh, we'll have the stock list video posted in the coming days. Uh, thanks again. This has been Jay Oliver's Guppies and Aquatics. We'll talk to you the next time.